Hello everyone, I'm Senor Mokolovar, and thank you for joining me here with the Silver Empire in the mod Road to 56. So last time, I believe we took out Peru and Ecuador, and we were planning on going to war with Colombia, but then... They were guaranteed by Canada. Sorry about the pause. Uh, I just noticed that actually, Ecuador still exists, and that doesn't make sense. No, 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 no. I, I annexed you last time. You're properly Silver Empire Clay. Thank you very much for playing. Anyways, I don't like this. I want to go to war with Peru, but they're guaranteed by the U.S., which basically means nothing right now. But they're also guaranteed by Canada, who's in a faction with all the other states that the... That were in the Allies, basically. But I don't want to go to war with Australia and Canada just yet. I don't think we're really ready yet. So, what we're going to do is maybe we'll go to war with Brazil right now. We might be able to be strong enough to take out the Brazilians. Now, let's uh, take a quick look at their strength. So, they're communist, but they are slowly becoming more and more fascist. Because they still have the synarchist influence. Doesn't make sense, I know. Doesn't make sense at all. Doesn't matter. If anything, that actually might be a good thing if they go fascist, because no one wants them to join a faction. Maybe except for the Axis, which wouldn't be good. But well, then that might put us in a good spot with the Allies for a while. Regardless, we have more manpower. We have probably close to the same, same, same number of divisions or so. They don't have a lot of planes. We actually have more planes than them. So if anything, going to war with them wouldn't be a bad idea. The only problem, though, is that they... Someone, Canada might try to guarantee their independence again, which I really don't like. So, up uh, here, no. Good. We need, like, four more political power or something, I think the game said, so. Three, two. Cool, yeah, go ahead and do that. Oh, we have the common cause. Very nice. We've got less supply consumption, because that'll be very, extremely useful for the uh, Brazilian jungles. Or jungles across South America, regardless of where they're at. We it is 1940. And, let's see. We could do this. More recovery rate. Can't quite do advanced sniper teams. That's fine with me. We could get more fuel, but we're okay on fuel. We really don't use too much fuel at the moment. Let's go ahead and grab some encryption. That'd be good. And we have six... Six research slots, that's so good. That's so good. Yeah, it's not making the garbage. Oh my gosh, we need steel. Surprisingly, we need steel. We, need, of course, need aluminum and rubber, but we're good on oil, actually, and really good on tungsten, which I'm actually very, very, very pleased with. We still need to make more capital ships, which we need to research more capital ships here. Um, but that's okay. That's okay. Recent military unification, that's alright, So, but we're doing that currently, which is nice. Something that, you know, Road to 56 has included in the game nice um last time i put on or you know divided up some more territory around here which was a, probably a pretty good idea i made the netherlands a little bigger because belgium was looking really ugly uh france i don't like france like this i really really don't france annex oh the fr you know what france is a puppet of the netherlands this is really weird in the netherlands you're Oh my gosh. You puppeted all of South America? Or South America, Africa? Oh my goodness. That is a ton of Dutch territory. That's actually fairly impressive, to be honest with you. Um, but let's choose the next focus. I should really start focusing on my navy a little bit more. To be honest with you, I really should. I could break the treaty, but I don't want to piss the UK off just yet. They're still part of the Allies. I don't, don't want to deal with them. Um, stability is always nice to get. More monthly population. That could actually be really useful, but I don't want to hurt my consumer goods right now. Aviation schools, not bad, not bad. We get, you know, bonuses to air doctrine and stuff like that. It might help if we do some naval ship stuff, though. Actually, we get bonus, send volunteers. That's okay, but at this point of the game, in 1940, I don't want to send volunteers anymore. Anything for... Land Doctrine? Armor would be important. Actually, armor is really important. Let's do naval stuff just because we can catch up to where we're at. Our navy is in a shameful state. Our ships would be sailing nowhere if they had to. A complete restructuring of our navy is intended. And I remember someone left a comment saying that a few days ago that I had my coast guards guarding more than just the coasts. Well, not now. So, good. Has anyone guaranteed Brazil? No. Good. Good so far. 
I mean, it's only been 10 days, but got to watch Canadians, which they're not that strong, which is good. They're democratic. They're guaranteed Colombia, which doesn't make any sense. They're committed to the war, but they are not in a war. Interesting. Uh, missing equipment production. We need we need dive bombers because I set one thing of one wing of dive bombers from 12 to 100, but not really using those. So I'm going to use them up until we have no more, and then get rid of them because I like tactical bombers, especially if we're fighting down here in South America. That's just no bueno. Oh, good. Recruitable population factor minus 30 percent because French Canadians don't want to go into a war they have no business doing. We definitely need more artillery, and medium bombers are doing pretty well. You know what? Hmm. Can I build anything else? Do I need anything else right now? Do we need anything else? Armored cards are nice. Not super necessary, though. Fighters are, of course, very important. Medium bombers, I love. I'd love more of this. But things... Everything has a cost. What are we building? More military factories, which is good. A civilian factory, which is good. And we'll start building up some of this. That's nice. Infrastructure would be good to build as well. We're running out of places to build stuff, so that's kind of why we need to take over Brazil, so we have some more territory to build stuff in. Which would be very nice. It looks like we keep trading away a factory, getting factories if we trade away our resources, which is fine with me. Uh, next up, can I throw something on here? Anti-tank, that wouldn't be ideal. Mountaineers... Definitely give them that. What is their supply of support equipment? Not bad. Go ahead and do that for now. And start training at another thing of Mountaineers. They're actually pretty useful. Uh, can I... Oh! Indian People's Republic has capitulated. Nice. Decryption side channel attack. Let's start focusing a little bit more on a navy. Let's go for this. That'd be great. Right now. How much longer until we can go to war with these guys? Please tell me. Good. They're still only guaranteed by the US, which means basically nothing. 60 days. Apparently, I lost a ship. I'm not sure how. I lost a sub somehow. So, yeah, I'm not sure how that happened. Their design, like I said before in an earlier video, not that bad. Not that bad. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, Republic of Malaysia. Wow. You don't see that too often. And? Beautiful. We have a full army here. I love it. And, of course, we have another army down here, which is good, but, you know... Oh, actually... Get rid of that. That was for earlier if we were going to war with Colombia. But we don't need that at the moment. And actually, let's see how many divisions I got. It feels weird playing Road to 56 after playing stuff like other mods, such as Old World Blues, Kaiserreich, or even Red Flood. What? Well, I've been criticized for weak policy for what? What? No. No. I'm trying to go to war with the Brazilians. What do you mean, weak policy? What do you mean? Who's writing this, you know, media journalism garbage? That's a bunch of trash, and we all know it. Criticized for weak policy. Do you not see that I took out half of South America? Siam, Siam joins the Greater uh, East Asian Code Prosperity Sphere. God, come on. You know, you take out half of South America, and then you get criticized for not doing enough. What? What? Uh, yeah, U.S. Because I'm not going to war with you, you... Or... If you're... Don't go to war with me and I'll keep trading with you. That's what I'm trying to say. Because you're already at war with the Mexicans. The Catholic Mexicans. And you actually aren't doing terrible. You're doing great. But not bad. I mean, you did take a little chunk of Texas. But they're expanding in Coahuila. I have no idea how to pronounce that. And you did take a little bit of Arizona. So, eh. Could be better, could be worse. But, man. I need Brazil. So that I can take their steel. Which is a little bit over here. A little bit over here. See, criticize for weak you know, policy, weak foreign policy. What are you talking about? Nice. Centralized fire control. Uh, yeah, Brazil has less resources than I thought. I thought that they would actually have more resources. Brazil's a huge place. Forward observers, more recon. Uh, company reconnaissance, which is nice. Actually, I should probably put some recon on these guys. Oh, you're almost done. That's good. Assassination of Trotsky. Uh oh. Encryption. Very nice. Very, very nice. That's good. 1940 stuff. Let's start doing some ammo 40. And I'm still keeping an eye on doing um, more naval stuff, which will be good. I doubt this will honestly turn into a full world conquest. I hope it doesn't turn into that. But you know what? If it does, I'm kind of okay with that. I've never played as a South American nation trying to conquer the entire world. So, And I'm also joined here with a cup of hot, hot silver empire green tea. Not coffee. No, not this time. Coffee is for the Brazilians, which we want to take a lot of. 
Oh, wait, the Finns capitulated. Are they fighting the Soviets? Yeah, they're fighting the Soviets. What's going on here? Oh, wait, the Soviets are still at war with the Allies, I believe. Yes, they are fighting the Allies. India. You're looking kind of blue. Looking kind of blue. Quit India movement. No, more daily autonomy gain. I told them to go communist. Yeah, and that... And they did, but they were kind of defeated. Focus on internal matters. Well, then. Bangladesh is here. Pakistan. I love your your hat, man. Muhammad, you kind of don't look like a Muhammad, but then again. Whatever. Whatever. House of Hashim. Very cool. Very cool. Uh, hello, Bros Tito. Of course, Germany, you're actually being very, very peaceful. Fe Venezuela has volunteers, as well as Catholic Mexico. I think we've already done this, Germany. Didn't you already go to war with France? I mean, yeah, I know they're a Dutch puppet, but there goes Guatemala. Um, but yeah, uh, yeah, go to war with them. You probably won't have any problems with those guys. Let's see, fleet modernization. That's oh, that's nice. That's not bad. Overseas train. Oh, naval experience gain. That could actually come in handy. Daily gain. That's actually really useful. If I do it early enough, yeah, let's do that. Overseas officer training. If the moment comes for our ships to fight over, their captains must know what to do. But they can only learn this in war. Sending them overseas, of course, will help with this matter. That's actually not bad. So I can start making more naval ship designs instead of just doing exercises. That's actually not bad. I kind of like that. And we just got rid of our military confusion, which is very, very nice. Uh, how many more days? Because that guy is kind of inexperienced. Now, nah, go ahead and just keep it on for that. How many divisions I got? Palista Ward Analysis. Up to 42, maybe. Oh, they're getting the land auction stuff. Hopefully they don't join the Allies. Since I am in my... I'm not even in a faction right now. We could probably do a fairly okay general push. I'm feeling a little bit good about this. I mean, this is before the war, so you never know. Throw on all those bombers, because I like the bombers. I like them. I like it when my enemies go kaboom. Over for you guys. There we go. Dog fighting experience will come in handy. Very good, very good. Oh, uh, yeah. Go ahead and do multi-altitude flying. Give me three seconds, and then we're going to try this. Hopefully this won't go too badly. And I want you to be relatively okay when you try this. All right, so far some of the battles are looking pretty good. Pretty good. Come on, America, do not get involved. I doubt you will, but you never know. Air Force, how's that coming along? In the south, we're doing okay. In the north, in the Amazons, we're doing okay. Trying to attack in the Amazons, not a great idea sometimes. Holy cow, you just obliterated your own... Yeah, go ahead and stop, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. you don't need to attack like crazy. Yeah, I mean, it's, it's like, attack if you can. Don't worry if, you, if you're not successful. Just, you know, chill. Um, yeah, let's do that. That looks pretty good. In the south, as long as we move in, at least in one area at a time, I feel pretty good about it. Some hawks, very good, very good. That's awesome. Let's get some more medium bombers. Better fighters are always good to have. Oh, wait, hold on, hold on. Please, for the love of God, stop training. Another light cruiser, very good. Do we... Okay, they're on their way to repair, good. Just repair for now. And I'm glad I sent you to the Pacific. Ooh. Keeping them over here probably wouldn't have been a good idea. Catholic Mexico? I like the Hispanic Alliance, but, um... I'm not super interested in fighting the U.S. right now. Maybe in the future. Perhaps in the future. Oh. And this is why you put guys down here. Because of stuff like this. So, ships... I told you all to repair. That was kind of a lie. If they land, this is not going to be very good for us. And they landed. That's not good. They're attacking us here. Give them more defense. Tell the army to move up north. You should be able to win right there. That should be pretty good. Right here. You might be able to win if you have enough support. Yep. Oh, yeah. That's looking pretty nice. Don't, don't, don't you dare. It's okay. You don't need to attack. The Amazon sucks attacking you too, so that's why we're not moving that way. Uh, we've found the enemy fleet... One of our subs has decided to engage them. Buenos Aires? Oh, that's not good. 
That's really not good. Got ahead, auto deploy. Are they coming in there? No. Good. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and make you under a new army. Carlos, hello, Carlos. Hope you're doing okay. Go ahead and kind of do whatever you need to do. We got some more research stuff. Let's get some more ship stuff going. 1940s cruiser hull. Pretty good. Where are you guys at? Are you? Oh, you're you're still you're way in the Pacific. Holy cow! Um, next up, attack here. Follow it up with some mountaineers. That'd be great. We should be able to win fairly okay. We've lost about twelve thousand versus their fifteen thousand, which is a little worse than I expected right now. Just a little bit worse. That's okay. Let's go ahead and push them in. They don't have a port, so oh, they oh my goodness, that's not good. That's really really not good. That's all right, though. We will make it up in time. Anywhere specific that we can make it. You guys took them out. Nice. Good job, guys. These guys are going to die. Just go ahead and retreat for now. That's okay. This, we can bait them into abusing their convoys that they put in there. Ching China. Oh, oh, holy cow. That's disgusting. Mmm, gotta love that green tea. At least it was when it's fresh. Nice and fresh tea. Come on, you guys can win. I believe in you. German Reich declared war in France. Well, that would be a lot more intimidating if that actually meant something important. But it really doesn't. Don't want to attack over a river. I really need more divisions, so... As long as they abandon the port, I'll feel kind of good about this. Go ahead. Move out, move out. Don't, don't worry about it too much. You guys help attack right now, too. We're going to need to put more uh, artillery into our divisions. Help push these guys out. Nice. Don't move. Don't move. Because it, that division is moving anyways. Have we found some enemy stuff? We found a small sect of the Brazilian Navy, which is good. And now we're starting to sink some of their convoys. I love getting more naval XP. I love it. Let you guys move around. No worries. No worries. You're getting attacked like crazy. You lost the battle, but that's not extremely important right now. What's important is that we keep up our attacks. Can you win here? A three, two, three, four. The Mexican Soviet Republic joined the UK. They're in the middle of a civil war against... Oh, they're dead. The Hispanic Alliance is dead. Unify Central America, you're dead. Oh, you took half, literally half of all the divisions. Well, there goes Catholic Mexico. Wait, what percentage were you... communist? My goodness. Friends, my goodness. This is the big crazy second second Mexican Revolution. Oh, my goodness. They've lost 49,000. We've lost 23,000. That's okay. Keep them kind of stationary. That'd be great. France, of course, capitulated. I mean, anyone with half the brain could see that. Uh, anywhere else? Can we move anywhere else? Not really. Good. Keep attacking there. That seems to be good for now. Give them a little bit more support for now, too. And nice. Go ahead and hold. Our divisions are. Ooh, they want to break out, but that's not going to work out so well for them. How are the ships doing? Still doing convoy rating. Good, good, good. A little bit of convoy rating right there. We got some coast guards. Make sure they do that tile as well. 18. That's going to be a lot of divisions we need, so I don't mind plopping you out a little bit early. Are we lacking anything? Just planes, for the most part. Nice. This isn't looking too bad. Now, Novo Hamburgo. Which I'm going to assume is like New Hamburg or something like that. Needs a couple divisions to be moved around, we'll say. Ah, we have 157 political power. Very nice. Army regrouping logistics isn't bad. Capital ship. I like the capital ship, just in case for our army. Or is there a decision I could take instead? Oh. Yeah, maybe we'll do this. More war propaganda? I like that. And I like improving workers' conditions. Region-wide stuff? I like that, too. So, let's get a little bit more stability for now. How about that? A little bit more stability. Yeah, it hurts our output just a wee bit. But that's okay. Alright, so I, I want to wait for these guys to get a little bit more strength before we attack. 59,000 men were lost from Brazil. Looks like the Dutch probably capitulated. There you go. German Congo. How many times is that going to exchange hands? 
The German Reich, are you at war with anyone? No, you're not. You're at peace once again. Yeah, buddy! Ten divisions! Heck yeah! Oh, yeah! That's nice. That's really nice. Yeah, come on, Germany. Yeah, help me out. Help me out. Ah, very good. Very good. They lost a convoy. And that's my plan this entire time. Move them in. Let them try to get some convoys over here. Sink those convoys. Let them lose manpower. It's all part of the plan. Now, was this hills? So we want to send the mountaineers here to attack. Follow it up with you. Follow it up with you, and then you, and then you, and then probably you, and then one more division of you. How many divisions are attacking from four different tiles? Six. That's not bad. Planes scrambled to do a little bit of damage. I love it. Next up, we'll attack here. Um, actually, you begin the attack here. That, that'd that be okay if you started attacking there. And he sent you to attack. And then one more here, too. Good. Crush them before they get too strong. They're running out of manpower, which is very, very nice. Good. Yes, let them attack us. Very nice. Uh, oh, we took, we took the fort. Okay, well, you know, that's okay. Once these divisions are done, I'll throw them onto the other army so we have more strength across the entire line. What are we building up? Infrastructure, which is nice. That's not bad. Let's build up another refinery. I could probably use the rubber, to be frank with you. That's a, it's a minor bit of rubber. Oh my goodness, yes. Let the Germans come in. You sent me just infantry, though. Which, you know, I guess it could be worse. Those look like some really thick boys. Oh, yeah. Give me those German boys. Let our guys get uh, move around a little bit. But look at that naval XP. Glorious. Next up, let us do... Oh, we can't do this? Oh, we have to be at peace. God dang it. Um, naval dockyards, that's not bad. Is there any way I can get more resources? It doesn't look like it. Military youth. Paramilitarism. I mean, that's not bad. We're good on manpower, but you know what? It takes time to mobilize. Let's just go and do military youth. ARG, military youth underscore desk. I love that one. I love the description. And do some war propaganda. That'd be good. I love the war propaganda. It makes me feel so good about myself. Four divisions attacking here against five. Wow, that's actually five divisions there. Yeah, don't attack. Yeah, don't 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 worry about that. You know what? If anything, you guys could maybe attack here instead. There is a river crossing over here, so we might want to attack here first, and then maybe we'll attack right here, or really anywhere else that needs to get attacked. Oh, we push it up here too. Oh, they're having a, t a tiny, tiny minor amount of attrition, which is good. Ruin their supplies. Good. Ruin them. The, the soy belt. The soy belt. What is that? More. Wow, more monthly population? Oh, that does not look good. Oh. So you guys look pretty darn defeated. Uh, Germans, I wouldn't recommend direct frontal attacks like that. Just in general, I probably wouldn't recommend that. You can probably stop doing that. I don't want to find the Brazilian Navy and just get blown the heck up. They only have 11 ships, though, so I'm not maybe too concerned about that. Oh, patrol right there. And how about, You guys come home first, and then we'll put you on there. Ammunition 40. Let's get support 40 next. That sounds pretty good to me. Let them come home. Are we... No, the Germans are pushing up. So, we'll push up with them. Come back down here. Nice. You know what? It, it really doesn't matter. Yeah, the Germans want to attack for us. I'll be more than happy to welcome into our hearts and minds. Can we win here? With extra strength? Five? Not really. There's too many divisions that way. That's unfortunate. Okay, cool. You're back here. Come over here, guys. You'll do a great job. Nice. I'm glad we got the Germans here to help us out. Is there a river here? It looks like there might not be. I only have, like... Can you go there directly? No, you cannot. That sucks. Anywhere else? Looks like they're suffering just a wee bit of a lack of stuff. Help them out here to attack. Good. Good so far. We got a lot of army XP. Well, at least it's some. It's not a lot. Go ahead and don't even move. You don't need to move. That's okay. Better radar is always helpful. It is getting close to 1941, so go ahead and get some more construction. I'm loving this. Loving it. Loving it. Loving it. 
Go ahead and do more Santa Cruz so we can get even more inf information around there. Germany, you are just doing a great job. I love the Germans in South America. Hmm. Next up seems like a pretty good spot to attack here. Could be wrong, could be wrong. I hope I'm not. Losses thus far, 44,000 versus 97,000. Oh, Germany, Germany, whoa, what are you doing? What are you doing? I will support your attacks if you let me know what's going on, man. Like, chill, hang out. Good. Uh, wait, what is that? Collect civilian aluminum utensils. What is that? Aluminum is a vital material for the war effort. In this time of need, it is necessary to organize collect points so that bikes, pots, and other objects can be reused for the war effort. When selected, I get one thing of aluminum in two different spots. I'll be frank with you, that's not much, but I like it so much, and I haven't seen this before, that I'm going to do it. Slowly but surely, we will conquer the Brazilian nation. And add them to our empire. Um, cruisers are nice. I need capital ships, but we're so far behind on these guys. It might be more worth it, honestly, to make some subs right now. They're cheap. They're effective. But... Uh, do that. We'll go with subs. I really want capital ships, but we might have to wait. Florianopolis, huh? Sounds like it, there's like a lot of Greeks there or something. Florianopolis. We'd like to attack here, but can we actually win? It's always a question. Can you actually win here? But happy 1941, everyone. Hope you're having a great, great year. Oh, we're attacking over river. Yeah, screw that. Attacking over river sucks. Mm, two divisions. I get attack with actually quite a few. Let's go from here. Take all but one. Attack that way. You can help attack as well. Can you actually win? I know they're defending in marshes. Yeah, you actually might be able to. Good, good, good. Ooh, just had my little last bit of green tea. Ooh, that tastes different. I'll say that. It tastes different. Now, with all these divisions around here, we should be able to smack five of these guys around. But, we might be more inclined to attack here instead. Could we pull an encirclement? Maybe. And hold one division each tile, because we can encircle like five guys down here. Yeah. If we can encircle these five, that'll be great. Losses 50, 67 versus 108,000. We actually have more divisions than them, which is awesome. Disperse industry, very good. Oh, we're done building more stuff. Um, what do we need? Rubber, aluminum, steel. I'm already building up the stuff which I like, but I want to continue to produce more rubber. If I can become the rubber capital of South America, or really of the world, then we won't have to deal with any of this. How much rubber does Brazil actually have? None. That's why we do it. Awesome, now they're attacking us because they're panicking. I love it when the enemy panics. Don't even reinforce the other areas. Just... Ireland. Ireland. I have never seen this before, Ireland. Who the heck is Resurrectionist Ireland? You're only in Northern Ireland, too? Ayn? O'Duffy? I know someone's last name is Duffy, but... Holy cow. Guys. You got four divisions. I mean, that's not bad. Uh, that's fairly equal, actually. Wait, does Ireland not have their own focus tree in Road to 56? Ah, oh, they kind of do. They kind of do. Yeah, it's... It's... Mm, it, it, eh, they have a... Eh, type of focus tree. Could be better. Whatever. Well, good luck, Ireland. To both of you. I'm sure I'll ally with someone... With one of you, maybe. Or just get rid of you. Yeah, taking five divisions isn't easy, but we've killed, like, two of them off, which is nice. Come on. You know what? Even sending these guys, they're not really worth using as infantry divisions, whatever. Military youth, pretty good. Let us next do state dockyards. Complete modernization. Let's do some stuff over here. 
Let's produce more infantry equipment. Some nations have developed really advanced weaponry. We can analyze this des desings in order to make our future weapons better. I think it means designs, but you know, that's just me. Awesome, great job. I know it took a lot of out of you guys, but it was worth it. It was definitely worth doing that. Okay, let's go ahead and redeploy the front line real quick. German Reich is over there. Catholic Mexico, you had so much potential. Oh, nope, well, there goes Ireland. Even less potential than uh, Ireland. Oof. Or less potential than Mexico, I guess. Uh, I think they're mobilizing more manpower. Oh, they definitely are. They definitely are. Which isn't ideal, but you know what? Let's keep getting our guys up to the, to the line. Where are you guys headed? If anything, I think you guys should probably attack right there. There's only two divisions there, which is good. Not all three of you are going to move. Go ahead and defeat them, which is nice. Good. Oh, I was wondering when we are going to get our next couple divisions, because those are actually going to be pretty important. You guys are doing nothing. Throw you on the line over here, too. Awesome. Actually. Actually. Could you move up this way? Good. Do that. I'm going to spread you this way as well. Maybe we can make another encirclement. Perhaps? Yes? Yes, please? Get everyone up there. Very nice. Do not let them move. Come on. Support 40. I like it. 1941 stuff. Better artillery from 1940. We still need to do. That's okay. Yeah. Do not let them move. Good. Get down there quickly if you can. So we can encircle those two divisions. I'm taking a quick look at stability and war support. It's going up, I think, still just a little bit, which is good. Come on. Awesome. We got better torpedoes. We killed them off immediately. Beautiful. <sighs> subs. Go with subs. Just beautiful. Come on, take that tile. Good. Both of you, can you come here? Can you help destroy the line a little bit? You might be able to. Yes, you will. Come on, take the tile so we can get these divisions out, out somewhere else. Move you guys here. Move you guys right here. Give me one. Attack that area. Oh, never mind. You already died. God, I love having the Germans here. It's so nice. Ah, oh, very good. Very good. Good job, guys. Good job. We'll take that too. How close is Brazil to capitulating? Not very close. They've lost 230,000 some soldiers, which is great, great, great. Good. Take that. Awesome. Let you guys get a little bit more fixated on the line. I know I'm taking I'm taking my time going to war with Brazil because it, this is the major enemy of our nation. Uh, good, good, good. You know what? Take all of you guys. Attack here. Oh God, no. Hold, 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 hold. You all attack. You, but you attack here. They shouldn't give us too much trouble. I know there's three divisions, but whatever. Good. Uh, industry. Assembly line production would be awesome. You're doing a great job over there. Where else shall we attack? Um, actually. Actually. Go ahead and break over the river. That's extremely important. Break up here as... Oh, no, there's... That's a huge tile. Can't even see that. Why are you... Don't... Don't worry about that, man. The Amazon... Just don't fight in the Amazons. No way, man. Did they lose? Good. That took probably quite a few thousand men with them. That, yeah, that's pretty... That's hard to fight through mountains. It's really hard to fight through mountains. And bad terrain and forests and stuff like that. If I told you to be attack very carefully, could you do it? Yes. You won't be successful everywhere, especially in the north. But in the south, especially in the south, I like what's going on. Do we have any more planes? That's a good thing to ask yourself from time to time. Do we have any more planes? And sometimes you'll find that the answer is yes. Yes, we do. Anything else? No, not enough bombers. I need more bombers. I need more metal. I need more pretty much of everything. Get Sao Paulo. Construction 5. No, 4. Yeah, numbers are... Roman numerals can be a little difficult from time to time. Whatever, you know, whatever. Artillery, we're doing well on tanks. I've done nothing on tanks, which is probably kind of a mistake. Get some logistic companies. That'll be important. Good. Good. Keep it up. Keep it up, guys. I don't want to send 
too many forces out, but you're doing pretty well. I feel confident enough to do that. Good. I was expecting another Mountaineer Division from eventually, and they and we've made it. We've made it. Good. Sao Paulo, you're doing all right. Study board equipment. Good. Next up, we're going to do equipment modernization. A soldier is nothing without his weapon. If we want to modernize our army, we need to modernize our equipment first. Only makes sense. Now, what can we do next? National character? Order above all? I really like this one, so we don't have any strikes. Let's do it. And then next, I'll do more improved worker conditions or region-wide industry stuff. Exploit North Central Chilean Tungsten. I like that, but even though we really don't need any more tungsten, I can still use it. Losses, 133,000 versus 260,000. Beautiful. Mexico still hasn't given up because, well, the Mexican Soviet Republic is getting rid of any access the Americans have to normal Mexico. Uh, America invaded Venezuela. We have forward observers. We have advanced fire bases. We have an excess amount of military factories. I can't build anything because we don't have enough rubber or steel. Is there anything that just uses oil or tungsten? <clears throat> oh, actually, we got some ships I can make. These are going to be actually pretty decent ships. I like it. Before we do anything else, can I upgrade this? N no, I don't want heavy cruiser stuff, rapid fire stuff. No, thank you. Better anti-air, perhaps? No, I still haven't done that either. That is not bueno. Oh, boy. Let's go, I guess, do that for now. There's not much else I can do with that, except to get better cruiser engines and better radar. That's okay, and better armor. That's nice. That's actually not too bad. Make some of that. Put you on one. Go to Buenos Aires. Good. Do I have... No, I do not. I could make heavy cruisers, actually. It's not worth it, though. It really isn't worth it. Put you at the bottom. What do I do with these extra... I don't know what to do with this. That costs steel. I need research tanks. Everything costs steel, and I hate it. Do that, do that, I guess. Another research slot. Excavation. Actually, what am I doing? Resource production. Steel mills. That would be good. Alright, raise you up to... Oh, you're already on medium stuff. Good. Does anyone have upgrades? No, you're Mountaineer, though. Bastilio. And then, Juan, you are... Fairly decently experienced. Now, everything is moving very slowly in the western... Northwest portion. While everything in the north... East or central east. Looking pretty nice, not gonna lie. Pretty darn nice. Keep going, guys. Keep pushing. Right here, I might recommend movement. They, uh, maybe we can't win there. Oh, huh. thought we might be able to. Whatever. Ghost Guards, we're gonna need more of you guys, too. I want to capitulate Brazil before this episode ends. It might happen, it might not. We're getting close to Rio de Janeiro. Oh, yeah, we definitely will be able to. We should definitely be able to. But they're giving us even more resistance than before, and I don't like that. Three divisions now are attacking. Can we win? Maybe if we have dispersed industry. Next up, excavation four. Guys, are we extracting any steel? Yes, we are. And if we could extract some more, that would be great. U.S., I will gladly request some more steel from you so I can produce more things more often. Let's go ahead and keep building another... Synthetic refinery. Very good, very good. Nice. We took Sao Paulo. They're attacking us back again. Peace conference is over. Submarines. Leftist International Venezuela was puppeted. 1940 sub. Not bad. Improved medium battery. I don't like this, however, because the Allies now have Mexico, the U.S., and that. They joined the Allies. You know what? Just in case something bad happens, I'm going to end the episode here so I can, if needed, restart the next episode just in case. Because I don't know how this is going to end now. But anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like, subscribe if you're new. I know this episode went on a little longer than half an hour, but whatever. And check out my Discord link below, and, and I will see you all tomorrow. Thanks for watching, and have a great, great day.